you guys, welcome back to my channel. Talking all about the best products to use for your hair, the best hydrators to use in winter, and how to take care of your hair when it's dry. If you live in a colder area, you know that winter can be brutal on your hair. We live here in Utah, and when it gets to be really cold outside, my hair dries out like crazy, so does my skin, and you have to use extra products to help maintain that so that it doesn't get even more damaged or more dry during those colder months. So I've gathered all of my favorite products right here. I'm gonna run down the list. I have things from leave-in treatments to shampoos to oils and we are going to be going over all of them today so if you're interested in watching this and wanting to learn how to take care of your dry hair stay tuned first things first let's talk shampoo and conditioner because that's something that everybody needs to use I gathered three of my favorites and I'm gonna to talk to you guys about them right now if you have followed me for years you know that I love Kevin Murphy we used to be a Kevin Murphy salon and we would buy all of their products and I am obsessed with pretty much everything that they offer this one I wanted to talk about is called smooth again so this is the Smooth Again Wash and Rinse. It's a shampoo and a conditioner. The Smooth Again line is really great for pretty much anyone, and that's why I love it so much. A lot of times, if you're doing hydrating shampoos, it can be a little too much if you have oily hair. They do have a hydrating series called Hydrate Me. I love that one, and it does work really well with all hair types. I feel like if you like to stay away from that, this is going to be a better option for you. So it's smoothing shampoo and smoothing conditioner. Luxuriously rich shampoo smooths and softens thick, coarse, or unruly hair. So this is really good for medium to thick hair, but it just adds that extra moisture in. So if your hair is fine, but it's really dry in the winter time, this is just gonna give you that extra boost of moisture that you're needing. So either this one or the Hydrate series is gonna be really good for dry hair. I have used the Smooth Again for a while and I absolutely love how it makes my hair feel. So this is my number one right now. I love, love, love this and it smells so good. Next up is Unite. I recently fell in love with Unite. I've always heard about it, but I didn't really use it a ton. And then Stu and I went and shadowed Marissa Sue in Arizona about a month and a half ago. We shadowed her and she uses like all Unite and I just got so interested in it after seeing what she was using and how she liked it. So I went and stocked up on a bunch of Unite after that and I have been so in love with all their products. This is called the Seven Seconds Shampoo and Conditioner. Moisture, Shine, and Protect. And it's basically just a daily moisturizing shampoo and conditioner. So it's going to be really good for all hair types and honestly everyone's hair needs moisture i know i do have a few clients who have like really oily hair by nature one of my best friends christina actually has really oily hair so she likes to avoid moisturizing shampoos because of that but in the winter time i really feel like anyone could benefit from moisture anyway just make sure you're not overdoing it the seven seconds goes together so it's the shampoo and conditioner they also have something called a seven seconds leave-in and i have that that i'm going to talk about but this is just the best shampoo and conditioner ever it leaves your hair silky soft it feels really smooth and hydrated afterwards. And I always recommend using products like Unite or Kevin Murphy. They're professional products. They have really good ingredients in them. And you just wanna make sure that you're taking care of your hair, especially if you pay to get it done. If you get extensions done or color done, you definitely wanna make sure you're using the best of the best so that you don't have to go back and get your hair done more often and spend more money because you're not taking care of it. All right, last but not least, when it comes to shampoo, I am going to talk about the Olaplex shampoo and conditioner. It goes without saying that I am obsessed with Olaplex. They're one of our sponsors and I have used them since they first came out and never looked back because they're incredible. What's great about their shampoo and conditioner is it's patented technology. So it has all of the same stuff that like the regular Olaplex has in their shampoo and conditioner. So you're getting that bond enhancement while you wash your hair and it's supposed to, um, and it's supposed to repair, strengthen, and hydrate for all hair types. So I've used this on so many different people and it works really great on everyone. And Olaplex is just like a unique product in and of itself. For the most part, I feel like most moisturizing shampoos are pretty comparable if it's a professional product, but Olaplex is just on its own playing field because of the patented technology in it and it works so great. So especially if you are someone who is either in the blonding process or you are a blonde and your hair is just chemically damaged a little bit or maybe just drier because the winter, Olaplex is going to be your best friend. So you cannot go wrong with the Olaplex shampoo and conditioner. Also, I just wanted to throw this in there that there may or may not be a Jay-Z hair care line coming soon and that's all I'm gonna say but I will definitely be doing another video like this when I have those products to talk about now I want to talk about masks and deep conditioning treatments there are so many different things out on the market and I gathered some of my favorite ones so I can talk about them with you guys here today 
I'm gonna start with Kevin Murphy again because I just love them. So the first one is the Hydrate Me mask and I love that their masks come in liters like this because a lot of times masks just come in smaller containers like some of these, which is still great, but I feel like this is just gonna last you so much longer. So this is the Hydrate Me mask. It's in the Hydrate series that I was talking about. It's moisturizing and smoothing and then it's a mask created for frizzy or coarse colored hair. It really is just gonna add moisture into your hair and anyone who has had their hair colored, which is like 95% of the world is going to benefit from this. So whether it's winter and your hair's dry or it's just because you are getting your hair colored and you need another, a little extra moisture, this is going to be your best friend. And all the masks usually have like their instructions on the back, but how I like to use deep conditioners like this is I will usually wash my hair and then I will do this very last and I'll let it sit on my hair while I shave my legs. So that way it's at least sitting for like five to 10 minutes and then rinse it out at the end. All right, then we have the Angel Mask by Kevin Murphy. And this is a strengthening and thickening conditioning treatment for fine colored hair. Basically, this is the same thing, but the hydrate one is focused more for like frizzy hair, coarse hair, thick hair, and this one's more for fine hair. The Angel series is really great for fine hair. I used to use that on my grandma because she's thinning out a little bit. The Angel wash and rinse is the best. And then this is the mask. So just depending on your hair type and texture is gonna be which one you decide to go with, but they both are really amazing. I've used both and love them. Next up, I do not know how to pronounce this brand, but I'm gonna do my best. I'll put it right here on the screen so you can see how it's spelt. Kiuni, do you know how to say that? Kiuni? Kiuni? Cuny? Cuny? Cuny. Like Beyonce. Like Beyonce. Cuny. No. But I feel like Cuny sounds cute. So okay. I'm going to go with Cuny. Um, it's a vital nutrition mask and it nourishes dry damaged hair. I picked this one up because it looked really interesting to me. And I've actually heard good things about this brand, even though I don't know how to pronounce it. But what I liked about this is it's for severely damaged hair and it has essential minerals in it that improve the hair's elasticity. And that was interesting to me because we all know that when we damage our hair with bleach or chemicals or anything like that, the elasticity stretches out. And that's why when you feel damaged hair, it kind of feels like cotton candy, especially when it's wet. So I feel like this is just going to be good for anyone that's maybe going through that. This is probably more of an intense deep conditioner. So if you're really struggling with dry or damaged hair, this one's going to be really good for you. Okay, I also picked this one up. It's the Saints and Sinners. This is called the Velvet Divine Hair Mask. And honestly, I bought this because of the name because that just sounded really luxurious. This intensely deep conditioning mask eliminates damage caused by chemicals, heat appliances, environmental stresses, and more. Ideal for dry, frizzy, chemically treated, curly, thermally damaged, unruly, coarse, or moisture-starved hair. Adds brilliant shine, moisture, compatibility, strength, and manageability while eliminating frizz. Free of gluten, parabens, iron, oxides, mineral oil, all that stuff. 100% vegan and cruelty free, which is awesome. But I love that this mask focused on heat damage because I think we forget that, you know, using heat can be so damaging to our hair. We always think that bleaching and coloring our hair is gonna be the worst thing for it, which it can be. And I'm living proof of that because I'm addicted to coloring my hair. But you forget that using your straightener and your flat iron, your curling irons, that can do just as much damage. And a lot of times if you get your hair done and then you're just immediately using heat on it, that's really what's gonna cause the breakage rather than just the bleaching itself. So I like that this mask focused on heat tools, kind of like repairing the damage that those can do. Next up, Olaplex once again. So this is the Bond Smoother from Olaplex. So this is number six and it's a leave-in reparative styling cream. So basically it's gonna give you all of the stuff that Olaplex gives you in their other products, but it's a leave-in and it helps you style the hair and you can leave it in as you, you know, like blow dry and do all that. So I feel like this is just gonna be a really great thing um, if you're pairing it with the shampoo and conditioner. Um, that Olaplex has and you're using the number three, which we're gonna talk about in a minute, it's always just good to use the same line across the board. So if you are gonna use the Olaplex shampoo, I would definitely recommend following up with these products as well. So that's the Bond Smoother number six. And then we also have the number three. So this is the leave-in and it repairs and strengthens all hair types. So it's really important to know that this is not a conditioner, it's a bond builder. So it's not necessarily a mask or a repair system or something like that, but it's going to be used as a treatment. So how it says to use it on the back is use one time a week, apply on damp towel dried hair and apply a generous amount from scalp to ends until hair is saturated. Leave on for a minimum of 10 minutes longer if desired. So what I do once again, is I leave this on in the shower while I'm shaving and it's usually like 10 to 15 minutes and then I'll rinse it out. And this really does go a long way. So especially if you are getting your hair colored by your hairdresser, make sure they use Olaplex in their lightener and then follow up with this at home. It's gonna be incredible. If your hairstylist is using Olaplex in the lightener, they should be adding number one to the lightener and then using number two at the bowl. Number three is basically your version of number two. It's what you take home to use. So you wanna make sure that if you're spending money to get your hair done, you're doing this as well to keep up on the health of your hair and just make sure that it's maintaining the color, the shine and the moisture that it needs. Now we're gonna move on 
on to styling products. I have a few of my favorites here and I'm gonna show you guys. Like I said, I've been obsessed with Unite. And so literally most of this is Unite. It's just been such a great product line and I've been really excited about it. So I have the seven seconds detangler. This is a leave-in conditioner. So we had that seven seconds shampoo and conditioner. This is the leave-in detangler and it's gonna be amazing for brushing out the hair. So if you're doing a client at the salon and you did like teasy life or they have like a really hard head of hair to comb out, this is gonna be your best friend. You spray it in before you do anything and then you brush through it. The teasy lights are gonna come out really nicely and it's just gonna kind of give them a nicer base to brush through their hair. Next up, we have the Blow and Set Lotion, and this is gonna be great for a blowout cream that lifts, curls, sculpts, and smooths to create shape. There is nothing like a good blow dry cream. If it can help speed up the time of your blow dry, give extra volume, and give shape to the client's hair, it's gonna take your blowouts to another level. I've been loving using this one. You wanna make sure with leave-ins like this that you don't do too much. You just wanna get a little bit in your hand and rub it through the hair. You don't wanna like saturate it since the hair is gonna be clean when you apply this. Now we have the Boosta Volumizing Spray. It says full weightless body. This spray builds body volume and fullness while delivering a beautiful and touchable finish. Indispensable when you heat style or blow dry, your hair will finally be in full swing. So basically you're going to use this to give extra volume before a blowout, whether you're doing it on a client or yourself. This is for your fine haired ladies who need a little extra volume, especially in the root area. So mixing this with the blowout spray is going to be like the perfect lead in both of these products together to give them that volume and a really nice blowout. I have the Go 365 hairspray. It's a three in one spray and it's a soft, medium, or strong hold which is awesome so it says three hairsprays all in one impossible or maybe not turn the nozzle to the desired strength it's as easy as one two three so I love this because it gives you options and I feel like this is so great because you don't have to have like three different hairsprays this is better for storage wise in the salon and you can choose the hold that you want depending on your client or your needs and it's a really great hairspray it holds really well but it doesn't feel crunchy which I love and then we also have the texturizing spray so this is the texturizer spray dry finishing this is my holy grail this is what got me hooked on Unite. I saw Marissa using it and I was like, that looks like a game changer. That's incredible. Unfreaking real, you guys. So amazing. The best texture spray I've ever used. And I am a texture spray snob. It adds volume. It adds life. It adds texture. It gives bounce. So many things. It just takes your curls to the next level. You know how on Instagram, the big beachy hair is big right now. This is what you need to achieve it. This is needed for every single client, every single hair type. I am obsessed with it. Okay, we have three more products to talk about. I wanted to talk about dry shampoo because this is a big one I get questions about a lot. This is one of my favorites right now. It's the IGK Invisible Dry Shampoo. It's called Jet Lag. Lightweight, cleanse level, weightless, buildable, and gentle. I love this one because I feel like it is really lightweight. Something I hate about dry shampoo is you can put it on and automatically you just feel like you have a lot of buildup on your hair and it feels really thick. And a lot of times it leaves like a cast on your hair. This one doesn't really do that. They have a bunch of different ones, but this one has been my favorite so far. And I feel like like it's really good for all hair types as well especially blondes because unless you are brunette you're, if you're brunette you're gonna need like a darker tinted one which when I was brunette I used the Batiste one and I really liked it this one by IGK is amazing I have another blowout spray for you. This is Orbe and it's the Royal Blowout Heat Styling Spray. This is great because it helps speed up your blow dries and it also has heat protectant in it, which is a necessity when you are using heat tools at all. Spray on damp hair from mid shaft to ends, go section by section to blow even smoother and straighter. So this is honestly one of the best products I've ever used for a leave-in. I love it. Orbe is incredible, but it is pricey, which is why I only included one of them in this video because I feel like Unite and Kevin Murphy are more of like an affordable range rather than Orbe is like really high up there, but it is really Good. This is the last one. I'm saving the best for last. This is the Jeezy Styles Co. Rose Hair Shine. This is a hair oil for your hair. We formulated this specifically for extensions because extensions lack the moisture that your own hair gets. So when you have extensions, you need to make sure you're moisturizing them mids to ends to keep them looking nice and healthy and feeling good. You also need this on your own hair, especially when it's dry outside. So if your hair is getting really staticky, if it's getting dry and feeling damaged, this is going to be great. When it comes to hair oils in general, you want to make sure that you avoid the root area. That's never going to be good. It's going to make your hair feel greasy and especially if you have extensions It's going to make them slip if you add oil up there So you just want to make sure this is the mids to ends and it's amazing. It smells like roses Literally, it's incredible at our class We usually pass this around and everyone like rubs it all over them because it smells so good But it smells like a rose garden, which is why it's the rose hair shine and it's incredible So you can get this on our website and if you use your stylist discount either being a student or a licensed cosmetologist You can save money on this to retail it to your clients You can also use that stylist discount for our brushes our hot tools and our hair as well. All right, you guys I hope you enjoyed this 
video talking about winter hydrators, all of my favorite products and how to care for your hair during the winter months and honestly just all the time. So let me know if you liked any of these products or if you are going to try them and then let me know what your favorites are in the comments below as well. Also let me know what types of videos you guys would like to see in the future. I have been so excited about diving back into hair videos on my channel and I just appreciate all the support. So thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and have a great day.